I had an incestuous relationship with my own son. I am Marie Antoinette, French queen from 1774 to 1793. The first few years I was queen were wonderful. I was a fashion icon and trendsetter. The people really liked me. However, my story gets crazy so watch until the end. My French people started growing increasingly restless. They were hungry and angry after suffering from years of economic hardship and political unrest, so they blamed the monarchy for their woes. In 1789, the French Revolution began. Some say it started after I said, let them eat cake, to my hungry and poor French citizens, however there is no evidence of this. The French Revolution was spearheaded by revolutionaries who sought to overthrow the monarchy and establish a republic. These revolutionaries, fueled by Enlightenment ideals of liberty, equality, and fraternity, saw the monarchy as an outdated and oppressive institution. The people stormed the Bastille prison, and they demanded that the king and queen be overthrown. Louis XVI and I tried to appease the people, but it was too late. The revolution was in full swing, and there was no stopping it. In 1792, the situation reached a boiling point when a mob stormed the Tuileries Palace, forcing my royal family to take refuge in the Legislative Assembly. The Assembly, under pressure from the revolutionaries, voted to imprison myself and the King. My son was forced to say that I had an incestuous relationship with him even though this was not true, and Louis XVI and I were arrested and imprisoned. We were put on trial for treason, and we were both found guilty. On January 21, 1793, Louis XVI was executed by the guillotine. I was executed on October 16, 1793. I was only 37 years old when I died. Even in death, I remain a symbol of the French Revolution. I am remembered as a queen who was loved by her people, but who was ultimately destroyed by the revolution.